Hi everyone, this is Dr. RFD again of Urban Smile Central Clinic and today with me is one of course one of my idol ever since I was young, one of the premier actress in the industry, Miss Susan Africa. Hi, yeah. thank you so much. She's wearing now, of course, the smile makeover that she had at Urban Smile Central Clinic. Just to give a quick recap, of course, when she visited the clinic, she was wearing an old porcelain with metal crowns and bridge in front. Of course, the side effect is of wearing a porcelain with metal is that the gums. And of course, the aesthetic part is not that so good because there's metal inside. So what I did was, I changed everything with, of course, a metal-free material, which is zirconia and porcelain. The one that she's wearing on top. And of course, our next project would be on the lower teeth. We'll be doing that in the succeeding weeks and months of 2024. Actually, she visited the clinic for around three appointments, including the dental cleaning, dental restoration, sinukata namin siya for final impression, trial feeding of the veneers. Then we install this. Uh, so yun yung buong kwento ng ginawa namin. And of course, today is her recall procedure and a little mini vlog with her. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for inviting me, Doc. Of course, it's a pleasure to see you in our clinic. Okay, our first question for Miss Susan is, can you compare the difference of your smile before and after your smile makeover? Oh, my smile now is more natural. It's more beautiful. I feel more confident with what Dr. RFD did to my teeth. And I would recommend all of you, if you want a better smile, come to Urban Clinic yet <laughs> and see Dr. RFD. Wow. Fair before, Paul. What was your ano, um, dilemma before visiting the clinic? Um, hindi po ako masyado confident nun because with due to age, um, nag-iba na yung color ng teeth ko and I didn't know what to do with it. I would go to other dentists and they would say, oh, mahirap ang whitening because it might make your teeth um, brittle. Yeah, brittle. brittle. So, Dr. RFD saved me actually. <laughs> <laughs> Hindi naman masama mag veneer, especially if it's indicated na. Of course, for the teeth of uh, Miss Susan, most of the teeth had restorations before. So, I would want the teeth to be more aesthetically pleasing. So, that's why I recommended veneer work. Kasi you cannot uh, cosmetically improve teeth kapag puro dental filling material lang. Yeah. Especially, of course, dental filling after one to three years next to stay under this color. Especially if, if we have habits like drinking wine, coffee, tea, soda. With the material that I utilize for her case, which is a combination of porcelain and zirconia, it's stain free on. Yeah. The point is stain. Yeah. Last visit, this was more than a month ago. Yeah. And of course, for sure, should you're a coffee drinker? Yes. So, wala namang stay up, up to this time, alright? And I thought na, pag yung ganong classing procedure, it would take a long, long time. But with Dr. RT, it took like, what, two, three mm. visits lang? Yeah. And then, you have beautiful teeth na. Yeah, actually, it, it, it's, it's approximately a month procedure. Kaya lang, syempre, alam mo na busy yung bare months, kaya medyo nadelay kami ng cementation. <laughs> yeah. So, next question po, Miss Susan, is, how's your new smile? Did the people around do you notice any changes with your smile? Um, siguro they would. They would like take a second look. But uh, they never really mentioned it. So uh, kudos to Doc. That means that what he put in my teeth are really, really looks natural. Mm -hmm. That is actually always my goal. Ang gusto ng mga tao, parang mga white na parang chiclet na bulky, mm -hmm. na sobrang white. Ang goal ko lagi ngayon is, gumanda yung teeth, nag-improve, but people won't notice, won't tell you, parang... Alam nilang gumanda, pero hindi nila nasabi na, imagine kasi if it's, kung baka siyang artificial, malalaman nila. Yes. So, for the case of Miss Susan, just like all the other cases, like Chito Miranda, like Geneva Cruz, and all other artists, other urban smells, my goal is, of course, to make it aesthetically pleasing, but re really look natural. Yes. Yun. Nakabase yes. sa color of the eye, the white part of the eye, and of course, the skin tone. Really? Mm. Okay. So, example, for the for the audience, for example, if the white part of the eye 
ang teeth mo is whiter than the white part of the eye, then it, it, it will not look natural. Oh. So, dapat same sila. I'll start looking at people's eyes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Alright. So, how do you feel about welcoming 2024 with a new smile? Oh, I feel more confident and it's a big blessing to be part of the Urban Smiles family. And um, I look forward to visiting you more often and I look forward to making more projects in 2024. Yeah. So, ngayon po ba? And Pwede, pwede na bang mag-donya, lalo ang... Yes! Marami na akong donya rules, forthcoming. <laughs> yeah. Oh, look, she's ever been here now. Oh, been here. Yes, pwede, pwede na mag-donya. <laughs> oh, and of course, kahit ni donya, pwede pa rin. Yes, yes. Kasi before, na, yung mga patients ko, dilemma nila, yung mga bata po. Uh -huh. Ang dilemma nila doon, hindi ako pwede magmayamang artista kasi nakabraces ako. Ah, wala no. So before, kapag bata, yung batang artista yung patient ko, yun yung dilemma nila. But of course, sa so urban, we also have invisible braces. Yes. So pwede nilang isuot yun. So kapag artist ka, actor ka, flight attendant, and hindi talaga pwede ang metallic braces, invisible braces you also have here in Urban Smiles. Yes. Alright? Aside from new smile, is there any changes or upgrade your new movie that we need to be excited about you, Miss Susan? Oh, I'm, I worked on a movie with the late Ronaldo Valdez last year. I think it was one of his last movies. Uh, was it already? No, not yet. It hasn't been shown yet. Oh. It, it, the title is Ang Apo Ninario Mabiti. Oh. oh, it's with the Bex Battalion pa naman. It's a very funny movie. Ah, it's a comedy. It's a comedy. It's a comedy. Kailan po siya lalabas? Um, we're not sure. Sometime in 2024, it's directed by Chad. Kinis? Yes. Oh, si yeah. Chad. Yeah. Nakatawa yeah. naman. Yeah. Ngayon ang mga movie ngayon, ang aga ginagawa. Oo. Oh. Ang dami kong Adam Artisa sa Urban. Parang last year pa, mga June pa last year ginawa. Tapos minilabas na. Oo, oh, lumabas na. So yun sa inyo po, kailan ginawa? Um, ginawa na ng September. September last year. Ah, uh, this year. Oh, February. then February. siguro mga January. Okay, then, mga May? Baka mga May. Alright. Sayang hindi nakahabol sa MMFF na pati. Tingnan natin sa Summer MMFF, sana makapasok. Ah, dalawa na ba ang MMFF? Dalawa na. The Summer and Anna. Oo, hindi na ako aware. Sana makapasok. Hindi na ako aware. Lahit ko parang makasama si Tita Cory sa mga events. Yeah. So, there. Of course, we are excited to watch your movie. Kapag pwede magpa-block screen, magpa-block screen tayo niya sa sa one of the branches Ay, here, but yeah, you can do yeah, it. Yeah, Basta yeah. pupunta dapat si Miss Susan. Of course, of <laughs> and course. And the next battalion are actually part of Urban, especially yeah. MC and Lassie. Yes, MC and Lassie are in the movie also. Yeah. Alright, so can you share us some of your New Year's resolution for 2024? Well, there's no other way to go but to get better. Better mentally, physically, and spiritually to be better people at the same time to keep your feet on the ground mm -hmm. and to share our success with other people. Wow. Like what you do. Thank you. Very inspiring. Nakatawa. Actually, alam nyo, bata pa lang ako nung unang meet namin ni Miss Susan sa Urban. Ang wala kong sinabi sa kanya, I am a fan. <laughs> Kasi syempre, yung age ko, I am 36 years old. Napanood ko, nasundan ko, yung napakahabang kwento ng Mara Clara. Ay, grabe, baka <laughs> baby pa kayo nun do. Uh, Elementary and high school, oh. nasundan ko yun yung notebook kung saan na hindi na makita ko yung notebook. <laughs> si Judy Ann and of yeah. course si Miss Gladys Reyes. Huh. Si Miss Gladys will soon be part of Urban. Hi, nice. Nakita kami in one of the events. Sabi niya, Doc, ilang buwan na lang. Oh, nice. <laughs> so nice. there I'm happy that to see of course Gladys and Gladys and the clinic as well as Miss Judy Ann Santos through Jing Moniz. Oh, Jing nice. Moniz is inviting Judy Ann to be part of Urban. Yes, scene. yes. So yun, so I remember when I was watching Mara Clark, Alam mo, nakakatuwa. Pag heavy drama talaga, may susan yun. Then, nakakatuwa kasi from, I think, mean, more than 20 years ago. Di ba, matagal na yun eh. Yeah. Up to now, she's very active. And hindi ako makapaniwala na kasama ko siya in Urban Smiles. Aww. When I actually shared the story with my parents, natuwa sila. Oh. Pinakita ko yung picture. Kasi syempre, fun din. Pag tanghali, nanonood kami ng Maraka. <laughs> o, oh, panghapon nyo doon. And, Miss Susan is actually a revelation to me. Ang um, bait, ang um, sobrang bait, Aww. sobrang humble. And sobrang talino. <laughs> Hindi ko na-expect. Ay, syempre, diba? Ang mga role ni Miss Susan is more of, mga alam mo na, sobrang simpleng mamamayan yung mga role niya na napapanood ko. Pero nakakatawa, you're learning a lot. Hindi lang sa craft niya being an actor, but of course, yung ano, 
yung life lessons. Ah, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Natutuwa ako kayo, Miss Susan, about that. And yeah. very generous. Yeah. Thank you po sa truffle chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> One of the best <laughs> chocolates na natikwan ko, ah. Really? So, oh. syempre, shiner ko sa mga pamangkin ko mm-hmm. kasi mahilig sila sa chocolates. Ah. Yun. So, thank you so much for trusting Urban Smiles. Oh, of course, I'll be seeing her again for some makeover on the, her lower teeth, which is, uh, of course, more easy to do because, uh, I think we'll be working on around 8 to 10 feet on the lower. Okay. Yeah, then lang. So, again, this is Dr. RFD and I'm with Miss Susan Africa. And we are here at Urban Smiles Dental Clinic where beautiful smiles are made. Come to Urban Smiles Dental Clinic so you can have beautiful teeth. Yes. Yes, bye. Thank you. Mm. Mm.